thank you. Uh, it is Eric Previn from the Third District, um, and um, this was an impressive uh, election. Obviously, uh, seventeen percent was higher. Uh, than we were expecting. So it is important to note that when you point out that 7 out of 10 voters uh, opted in for H, it was 7 out of 10 uh, in 17 out of 100. So it is a little bit less impressive, but it is still a resounding support for Measure H, and that is uh, noteworthy. Um, 486,000 uh, vote by mail uh, ballots in LA County causes an eyebrow to pop almost off the head. We, we enjoy uh, vote by mail because it's convenient, but there has been there have been concerns, and I know that uh, one of um, my co-candidates in the race for mayor, I I nabbed 0.74 percent of the vote, or 3,023 votes. So so nothing to be proud of, but something uh, to mention. Um, pointed out that he looked at in CD5 where Coretz uh, mushed down uh, Mr. his challenger. No, I have two minutes on this one. Thank you. They held up the two fingers. So thank you. Um, but what he found was that out of 60 people who voted in one precinct, interestingly enough, um, 10 of them only voted for Measure S, which was strange, he thought, because, and he started to scan, what could that be? And of course, what has come up, and I know uh, Ms. Kuehl uh, and Mr. Goldstein periodically clash about, well, what about all these dead voters and uh, land, um, lessee, people who rent tenants, who then move on and the, the ballots keep coming. And I know Mr. Logan is working hard on weeding out any of those uh, expired voters who, don't, who are no longer, but it is worth noting that's a lot of vote by mail. So that is a little bit of concern. And finally, I'll just simply say this. Uh, it's $18,000 in a county supervisor race to have a little blurb about you. We should make it, and this board should take a leading role, so that any candidate who uh, runs for office can have a blurb about themselves in, a, in, in the ballot. That is, that would, I know that's not an incumbent's dream, but that is what people want. They want to understand who you are and what you're about. So let's make that free Thank for candidates. Thank you very candidates. much for your Thank testimony. You. Next speaker, please.